Felichko, and she is uh, she's the heart and soul of our, our veteran support program. And uh, you know, I think without her, we, we wouldn't be doing anywhere near as much as we are. Uh, and we're and we're trying to do more. We're actually uh, investigating the possibility of starting a, an ROTC affiliate at Centenary that would uh, you know engage even even further with the military. And for for us. Um, you know, we, uh, there's so many things to say about this. You know, I'm of the generation that uh, saw the troops coming back from Vietnam in the 70s. And, you know, you think about how things have, have changed and not changed since that time. Uh, I think we've done, I think we understand what veterans go through as a culture. I think we understand that better than we used to. But I don't think we've gotten as far as we need to go uh, in terms of addressing the issues that, that veterans face. And that's why Operation Chill Out is so important in really uh, addressing the needs of veterans when they're at the, lo the lowest point in their lives. Um, and, you know, for, um, for us, it, it, it's, um, you know, some of the statistics that you heard before, let me, I'm gonna give you a couple of others. Um, we have a we, the homeless problem in the United States has actually gotten better. There are fewer homeless people than there used to be, but 11 percent, fully 11 percent of the homeless are veterans, and 20 percent of the male homeless population are veterans, and 51 percent of the homeless veterans have disabilities. So there are so many things stacked against um, the homeless veterans that any help that we can give them is certainly much appreciated and very much needed. 50% have a serious mental illness and 70% have substance abuse issues. So those are really an indication that we have not done anywhere near enough to solve the issues that, that our veterans face. And New Jersey has some specific statistics that are, um, that are also really concerning. The, the homeless population in New Jersey is down by 37.9% since 2010. I mean, that's huge. That, these are statistics from 2017. But listen to this. Um, in New Jersey, there were 583 homeless veterans in the state in 2017, and that's an increase of 4.8% over 2016 and 2.8% since 2010. So even though we're solving the homeless problem in general, we just have a, a really long ways to go in terms of, um, you know, addressing uh, addressing the veterans population. And you know, one of the things that um, one of the things that makes veterans so important to Centenary is the fact that we don't just, you know, we don't see education as, you know, having people learn stuff in a classroom and then go out and apply it in the world. We see our students' education as really a part of the real world. And I'm